Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining me today in Skyrim. I hope you're all having a great day. There we are. Currently doing the Dawn card quest. Don't think I don't see you eyeing me up and down. Yeah, Sophia. Candy, right, I think Serana wants to talk to us. If you're thinking what I think you are thinking, that thing What's on your mind? I do like that moth priest Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. I think I know where we can start looking. That's rather convenient. Why didn't you say something earlier? Half the people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. That doesn't exactly make me want to open up. I got a warmer welcome from my father, and that's saying something. What is it between you two? Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. So where is this Elder Scroll? We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. You said you didn't know where she went. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Sounds like she was being cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? In Castle Volkahar? Wait, that almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too... peaceful. Isn't that pretty risky, staying around the castle? Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. They aren't going to let us use the front door. True. But I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Let's go to the castle's secret entrance. It's around the side of the castle. Let's move. Right, castle Volkihor. Volky here, Volky here. Here we come. I just sent me uh Press channel up, explore Castle Volkihar's courtyard. Right, let's go. Don't know why, it's always night time when I come so out of this place. With you Shut up, Sophia. Alright, I guess we're just going to fast travel to the castle and run around the back. But they're not going to just let us yeah. in, are they? Or maybe they are. Okay, just going to trot round the back. I thought there were a couple of uh, guards out here, yeah, but clearly I was wrong. Doesn't look so big from down here. I mean, it is big, but well, even bigger. It looks pretty big to me. Sophia, seriously. Have you never heard of personal space? Who's there? Here we go. And again shot at. Oh seriously? How the hell do I get out of here? And I've got an arrow in my back as well. Them two are no good whatsoever. Have they, little bugger? It's 
suppose best go and give Sophia a hand. Hey, the only thing that's actually, actually useful about her is that she just goes and destroys everything. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> Okay, where's the entrance? Volkihar Undercroft. In here, I guess. Who's there? Skiva. Who's there? And death hounds. Who's there? Suits you, sir. Is that what you're going to say? Who's there? I don't like those death hounds. Another one. Come here, Feral. The journal fragment. Let's have a little read of that. Not good enough to live in this stupid keep, am I? Stupid sods don't realise I've moved into the Undercroft and started taking control of their own death hounds. I'll get my revenge. I don't think he will somehow. Elven Dagger of Fear. Hmm. Got any more? Is that friend or foe down there? Sophia's going for a little swim. I see the little trap on the side there. Just. Oh, can I get it? Yeah, just about. Alright, now we can have the one gold piece. What did you need? A few um, enchanted arrows, though. And uh, we've got to watch out for the gargoyles. Which are probably going to come to life at some point. And wait. Ooh. Skill book. A hypothetical a hypothetical treachery, a one act play. Yeah, it goes on too long. We'll just take that. And the Ethereum Wars. We might as well add this quest to our journal. We're going to get that done at some point. I've got your back. Take a left up here. This is one of those weird double barred security measures that my father put. I am going to get ready to get jumped because I can hear a lot of sk skitterings and squirrelings and whatnot. Oh shit. That's getting a bit airy in there. Oh, Death Hounds, there's more than what I thought there was. What there normally is? I don't know. Nice. Uh, at least we know where the bodies come through. Yeah, I don't think there's that many Death Hounds in here. Clearly I'm wrong. 
Well done, yeah, you got the blood splits. Look fresh, but then there's a skeleton next to them. Men already constantly complain about being shouted at by the wives. Oh, Sophia, I'm not shouting you in a minute. Imagine a dragonborn woman shouting at her husband. That would really give him something to complain about. Oh, don't let it, don't let it. Nice. You just wait to take one of things down, on it? So I'm guessing now we do the other way. Over that footbridge. Can't remember, it's been so long since I've done this. Oh no, it's that way, isn't it? Oh. This leads out to the courtyard. Just head for the door. Just head for the door, she says. Very nice. A bit sparse out here. Hmm. Right, okay. Missing crest. Let's go find the crests. Or do I need to speak to Serana first? Who is stuck? Yes. What did you need? I need you to duck. Any clues about the other Elder Scroll? Dexian said something about that scroll. What was it? Something to do with dragons, I think. Maybe we should try asking at the College of Winterhold. Sounds like something they'd know about. Were you and Valerica close? Before my father became obsessed with a prophecy, my mother and I spent quite a bit of time together. She was very fond of her alchemical garden in the castle courtyard. She taught me quite a bit about cultivating quality regions. So you always got along? Like the best of friends. I would never hesitate to share anything with her. But then it all changed. It was very sudden. It was almost like one day we were a normal family, and then the next... I didn't know who they were. I'd try to visit my mother in the garden, and she'd quickly shoo me away, saying she was much too busy. That's why we're headed there? She had to be up to something in that garden. I'm hoping it's a clue that will tell us where she went. Right, uh, you duck. I'll go and find these missing crests. See if I can remember where they are. Yeah, there's one. Looks like radiated water as well, doesn't it? From Fallout. So I'm pretty sure there's one in this flower bed. There's two. And we just got to find one more. There we go. It wasn't too difficult. A gargoyle. Oh, not that gargoyle. So what's that half moon? Maybe present moon. Where's the other one go? Is that a full moon or a no moon? One or the other. Ooh, twisted turnies. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what's going on with this tree. Still, it's not really causing us a big problem, is it? Volkihar ruins. <laughs> oh, that makes a change, doesn't it? Sophia's photo bombing again. Which actually is quite nice up close. <laughs> Pull the lever. 
take the money. And the other bit of money. I've never even seen this part of the castle before. Be careful. I don't know what might be around. Well, whatever it is, it looks like it's been hungry. There we go. Come on, boys. Done and done. All right, let's take care of that a lot. Just quickly have a look, see if they've got anything on them worthwhile. Who's there? Mr. Gargoyle, sir. Headsman axed him. We're getting close. I'm sure of it. Headsman's axe is doing a good job. Get over the door. The way of the cobwebs. Oh, that's a bit disappointing. I thought I might have gone somewhere. Oh, oh. let me jump. Got a couple more. Yeah, that'll teach you. A stray from combat to lock and pick, picking locks. Anything good? Take the lantern. No. Nope. We have a soul gem and oh, there's... Well, I just... Can't actually... Pick them up. Can I? Nope. Spikes hurt. Oh, and by the way, I really did a mod for parts of my IFT so that um, Lara's spells don't hurt me, but it looks like they're hurting everybody else. Alright. I don't think there's a fix for this. It normally works anyway. Do you know what? Sodja, you just go on a fight. I'm going to carry on through here. Sod a lot of you. And I'm also probably going to get extremely lost. Yep, they're all still fighting. What kind of this mystical magical wonder known as the Fountain of Booth? Do you think the stories are true? It's your hope so. I would never go sober again. Got a few more skeletons in here. It's Sophia's kind of taken out for me before I even get there. I know you're going to come alive. All right, I know you're not going to come alive. Here we go. I could do that in enchantments, this axe. 
Over the summit absorbs health, something like that. So did that actually open anything up? Keep hitting the blooming... Oi! Someone just shot me with the magic then. This one's a little bit tougher than the others. But luckily, I've got Sophia. Very sure there is another way of doing this if you don't have the uh, expert lock picking skill. Or if you can't pick the lock. Uh, which way? Oh, come on, skeleton. Yes, I'm getting lots of arrows. That didn't really hurt. Seriously, you just shot me in the ass. That's pretty cool. All the skulls there. A little display case. Sophia! I don't think he's going to come alive because he's actually encased in a block. Let's just get all of my... Uh, Preparations ready because I think everything else is going to come alive in here. We can run up the ladder. Oh. This axe is a little bit on the slow side, side I'm not going to lie. Ooh, look at them boots there. They've just been blasted with frost, haven't they? These action cams, death cams, what you want to call them, are cool. Just vampire boots. Ooh, a silver sword. Can leave all that. Not going to carry all the tit around with me. And turn the candlestick. And watch the wall. I love secret passages like this. Here we go then. Nice. Got to go to this spot here. Splash is not looking good. Well, where's Serana? Do you know what? Let's just gather some of this stuff over here. Serana coming. Lost books. Well, I'm just going to wait a bit, see if she turns up. There she is. Look at this place. This has to be it. 
I knew she was deep into necromancy. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Okay, so she's busy at the moment. What have we got here? Ground, finely ground oh, bone meal. She must have spent years collecting these components. And what's this thing? I'm right behind you. It's a soul can. I'm not sure about this circle, but it's obviously something. Valerica's journal. That might come in handy. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Let's take a look around. There has to be something here that tells us where she's gone. Do you think this would help? You found her journal. Let me what take a look at it. What even is that? Like seriously. What's this soul cairn that she mentions? I only know what she told me. Well, we know what's inside she Sophia's a head now, don't we? Gems, that the Not a lot. Of them don't just vanish when they're used. They end up in the soul Thank cairn. Thank you. Why did she care where you souls went? The Soul Cairn is home to very powerful beings. Necromancers send them souls and receive powers of their own in return. My mother spent a lot of time trying to contact them directly, to travel to the Soul Cairn itself. If she made it there, we'll find her. That circle in the center of the room is definitely some type of portal. If I'm reading this right, there's a formula here that should give us safe passage into the Soul Cairn. What do we need? A handful of soul gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. Ah, oh, damn it. What's wrong? We're also going to need a sample of her blood, which, if we could get that, we wouldn't even be trying to do this in the first place. You share her blood? Hmm, not bad. We'd better hope that's good enough. Mistakes with these kind of portals can be... gruesome. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get started. Are all of those ingredients here? Oh, definitely. Mother would have plenty of those materials in her laboratory. You just need to find them. Well, we've got the void salts. And I can never find all the other bits. Makes me ages. So we've got the void salts, we need so a handful of soul gems and no, we haven't got the void salts. Having trouble finding those ingredients. Soul gem shards, we need those. Is the void salts we need, it's the bone meal we've got. I'll get there eventually. Maybe. Purified voice salts. There we go. Got there eventually. Get the ingredients in that vessel and let me know when you're ready. Just yes, boss. The vessel. Then the rest is up to me. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. Can I ask you something first? Of course. What is it? What will you do if we find your mother? I've been asking myself the same thing since we came back to the castle. She was so sure of what we did to my father. I couldn't help but go along with her. I never thought of the cost. It sounds like she did everything for your sake. Possibly. I guess even a vampire mother is still a mother. She worried about me, about all of us, but she wanted to get me as far away from my father as possible before he really went over the edge. We won't know until we find her. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I just didn't expect anyone to care how I felt about her. Thank you. Are we ready then? Ready as we're never gonna be. Let's get that portal open. 
All right, here goes. That's not bad. Not bad at all, Serana. Okay, we ready? Let's go and get burnt. Yay! Are you alright? That looked painful. It was painful. It was. What happened? Now that I think about it, I should have expected that. Sorry. It's hard to describe. The soul cairn is... Well, hungry, for lack of a better word. It's trying to take your life essence as payment. So there's no way in, then? There might be, but I don't think you're going to like it. Vampires aren't counted among the living. I could probably go through there without a problem. Are you saying that I need to become a vampire? Not your first choice, I guess. There has to be another way. Maybe. We could just pay the toll another way. It wants a soul, so we give it a soul. Yours. Wouldn't that kill me? My mother taught me a trick or two. I could partially soul trap you and offer that gem to the ideal masters. It might be enough to satisfy them. It would make you a bit weaker when we travel through the soul cairn, but we might be able to fix that once we're inside. Maybe. Those are my only options? I'm sorry. I wish I knew a better way, something that would be easier for you. Just know that whatever path you choose, I won't think any less of you. Sometimes things just have to be done. I know that better than anybody. Great. Soul Trap to become a vampire. Marvelous options. Do you know what? Every single time I've played this and gone through there, I've become a vampire think just this once just in this playthrough I'm going to let her soul trap me have you made up your mind? soul trap me I won't feel right as a vampire are you sure? I'm willing to do it but you need to think it through you'll remain mortal but you'll find yourself weakened within the soul cairn do I really want to be weakened inside the soul cairn? I mean, it's an awful... Do you know what? I'm ready. I'm ready. Don't do this. I know this is difficult for you. I hope you trust me. I'd never do anything that could hurt you. I trust you completely. Thank you. Let's not waste any more time then. I promise to make this as painless as possible. Hold still. Uh, was that it? Let's go. My mother must be waiting on the other side of that thing. Okay, Geronimo. What do you reckon? Let's go. My mother must be waiting on the other side of that thing. Let's do this. Woo! Yeah. I feel terrible for the dead who end up here for eternity. It seems awful. But they're still suffering. Wow, it's very bright here. I can see all the way over there. Normally when I come in here, I can't see this much. Okay, so I think this is a good place to end this video. Um, I don't want to uh, do the whole of the soul cairn today, because it'd be like a two-hour video at least. There's an awful lot to it. I don't know whether or not I'm going to do the whole lot, or just carry on with the main storyline. Anyway, blood cairn next... Uh, soul cairn, sorry, next time. Uh, we will go after the towers, obviously. Um, go and find um, Ugh, Valeria. So that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like, and if you don't already, why not subscribe to my channel? Follow along, follow along for more of my content. Until next episode, look after yourselves and take care, and I shall see you again soon. Bye bye. It is really bright in here. A word of advice. Really bright. Oh, we can get art bark as well.